On Thursday, December 5th, the Burlington Police Department joined the Billerica and Tewksbury Police Departments to present a reading of the play Recovery at Billerica's Marshall Middle School. Written by Anne Lucas and based on her experiences with her own daughter, the play shows the struggles of three young women suffering from addiction and how it impacts both them and their mothers. It is a pointed look at how substance abuse can cause real harm, even death, and that the road to recovery is difficult and not a straight line. The event was put on to give audience members a look at what addiction is really like and to let them know that if they have a family member or loved one suffering from it, they are not alone, do not need to feel shame, and that help is out there. One of the most important things to me is that people really understand that this is a disease like heart disease or diabetes and that you shouldn't be ashamed that your child is sick. You know, there's a lot of secrecy, there's a lot of shame involved. If my kid had had diabetes, I would have had maybe a GoFundMe page. But when your kid is an addict, you don't want to tell anyone because I actually had people, one woman say to me, well, it's because of the kind of mother you are. Well, I know that's not true. People who are all different kinds of parents have drug addicted children. And that's what a lot of families go through because they feel like they're going to get more judgment than support. And so we want people to know that's the absolute opposite and there's a lot of support out there. And everybody has been touched by this epidemic, whether it's within their household directly or friends or other loved ones. Um, and so we need people to know that there's resources to help. Events like this are really important because people need to know that they're not alone, that other people are, are dealing with these things, families in particular. We look forward to events uh, like this one tonight because it really supplements and reinforces everything we're doing. We're so fortunate to have our PARI unit in Burlington so we can provide those other elements, uh, the education, the treatment, because this is a problem that is hitting families across the nation. Members of the Burlington Police Department emphasize that they are there to be a resource for people with addiction. While they still make drug arrests to try and prevent more substances finding their way to victims, they are not looking to punish anyone seeking help. Our, whole, uh, our approach now is a holistic approach. It's not enough to, to just be out there enforcing the laws. This, this is a problem that, that requires education, awareness, and treatment, and providing folks treatment. Uh, it's a much more open-minded approach. It's a holistic approach. And it's really uh, a, a much better approach to even give us any chance at all of, of helping folks. Enforcement alone, we know that, that, that wouldn't work. That's only one component. This philosophy from law enforcement is praised by the playwright. Well, it's amazing to me that these de police departments are so forward-looking, are so willing to engage with the community um, and really bring healing and health to their communities. It's a, it's a revelation and I think it's also something that the um, world kind of needs to understand that law enforcement has changed because I think there's an attitude sometimes toward law enforcement of fear and, and secrecy from them. We don't want to tell them what's wrong, but they're really leaning into this with compassion and I think that's amazing. For Marshall Middle School, I'm B News Director Rich Hosford.